Hello and welcome. Today I will uh, make a very simple 3D model. I, I'm a programmer. I, I really don't do things like 3D modeling in my work, but I think it's uh, it's it's kind of fun. Uh, so today I will do a spaceship because uh, a spaceship can look, you know, have any form or shape. You know, there's few spaceships, and all of them are ugly. So, so I will, um, I will make a futurist, uh, futuristic one. Let's see if I can accomplish this um, with my my really, really, you know, basic skills in this. So first, I go to front or to, or maybe not. Uh, let's do a. Um, yeah. Let's begin with creating the rear and uh, the front and you know stuff like that. Um, let's see here. Where? Yeah, I need to be in edit mode, of course. Here. So I I will first start to create something. Well, that will be the equivalence of of, of the front end of of, of the it uh, of a car, maybe you know the grill or what or what do you call it in English? I don't know. And uh, yeah, this will be the the um, yeah uh, the end the the rear and the back. Yeah. Uh, oh sh so let's see here. Uh, if I, yeah, that's that looks a little bit better. Yeah, the engine will be back here, I think. So I did this because it's much simpler to do to do um, this before I start mirroring. Um, we want to have uh, as few few edges and verts as possible. So it's it will be low poly. I can promise you. I'm not really there with the high poly stuff yet. So uh, now we're, we're gonna mirror, mirror the model. So that's control. R. First we need to cut it in half. So we do that like that. And yeah, this is more documentation for myself to see where I am in like five years, but because I'm tr gonna try to do this more often now. Okay, so let's cut that thing in half now. We need to, well, let's. Mm. Yeah, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Uh, oh, no. This is hard. Uh, select those and then we do. Let's do delete here. Delete. No, what? I need to do like this, of course. So, yeah, I, I, I really can't you know give you any lessons in this but what I can do is giving you a good laugh I guess uh, that's that's why we're doing this so uh, let's see here let's select oh no I'm really not good with this lasso thing. No. But apparently this is the way you should work if you're a pro, so I will try I I will try to be as professional as I can. So yeah, let's let's try to delete all the faces. Uh 
no. Oh well. Let's keep on trying deleting stuff then. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be hilarious. Uh, yeah. Uh, gonna. Oh, I don't know. Um, oh, what is this? This is hard. Let's try that stuff again. Okay, we have that. Hmm. How can we? Oh, let's. Okay. Let's do it like this instead. We will try to. You know, sometimes you need to change your plan. You know? You can't always have the perfect run. Everybody use the, their best images. I'm 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 trying to be true here. So yeah, let's delete this. All the faces. Yeah. Now so now we ca ha have cut this thing in half. Now let's see. Yeah. Uh, we will add a modifier a mirror with the clipping oh yeah oh yeah so now let's get the move yeah you know move stuff around so we will get the basic shape of this I wonder if the, my my plan will work yeah, hope so. let's hope so. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. Be but we should, of course, lock. We could do it like this. And, yeah, that looks good. Let's push that up. It's, it's going to be a real... Oh no. Of course I need to to select these ones. See maybe could this work? Could, yeah, it works. Nice. So this is probably not how a pro would work with this, but but I'm learning. Yeah. So Yeah, we could probably, mm, yeah, we should probably lower the front. It looks a bit ridiculous right now. And maybe we could, we could do something. Mm, let's select this, uh, oh my God, this edge and move it up a little bit. And this edge, move it down a little bit. Uh, maybe. What do you think? Uh, you can't answer. So, yeah. Oh, my God. It looks not too bad, actually. So, uh, can we do something back here? No, that looks pretty good, actually. Maybe we could move this uh, we don't need that big of a yeah that looks I, I like the basic shape of this so let's save it uh, to something be, 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 be. Yes, no, we will save it. Ah, let's save it in, we make a new one here. Blender, yeah, that's good. Well, let's call this craft. One ah, spacecraft, space 
Minecraft one. I guess I will do more of these. Yeah, let's say Blender fine. Yeah, uh, oh cool. Um yeah, let's get cracking. You know, the, the I think the hardest part with with uh, with the, you know 3D modeling is all the planning. It's so much planning when you're when you're doing all the you know where all the um, edges and whatever is going. It's really dig difficult, I think. But yeah, so I I, w I want something. To be the wings. Let's see. We well, let's you know see what we can do. Yeah, why no? Well, or maybe we that's we could be happy with that. Maybe. Yeah, could be cool. Or we actually. Yeah, let's do this instead. You see, planning is everything in this 3D stuff so I will extrude because this is going to be the front and I want it to look a little uh, you know rem to remind a little bit of a, of a, uh, a car front kind of so let's do it like that and then of course we need to to make a hole here for the engine you know the all the fire and smoke will go out this way oh well, maybe not smoke but fire at least so let's do this yeah yeah let's make it deep whoa no not that deep but pretty deep yeah that would that will probably work oh my god i'm so bad at this but yeah Let's continue. Yeah, and the front. Yeah, we need to fix this. Uh, we should probably have done that before, but okay. Uh, it would probably have been easier, but just by selecting these two guys, I think we will be able to make it thinner. Yeah, let's make it like that is cool yeah you will see let's see here yeah it should probably be a little bit taller I think uh, a little longer rather, rather not taller so we need to oh this is why planning is you know if you do things the right way you won't need to select all these things by hand if you plan if you have a good plan there's less selecting and more moving I think well that's my opinion let's see here so it's about four units yeah that's that's good so uh, let's see here we need let's let's uh, do some uh, let's save here and let's try some stuff here so I will do like this and this now we will select that edge and see if we can what yeah that that looks pretty pretty weird right but wait a minute if we if we select this vertex and do like this do you see yeah, it doesn't look that bad, right? It looks pretty cool. Maybe, or 
we do like this this will be even better I think planning is everything so we just make this right and oh my god it starts to look like a spaceship right man so right now it still looks a bit you know it needs it needs a little bit more you know it's a bit too too you know sh corny ish so yeah let's see what we can do um, about that it looks pretty cool from above though so but let's see if we can improve this uh, so yeah we do control R or oh. could that be something we could maybe uh, let's see let's keep it in the center let's have could we maybe 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 yeah we could possibly yeah let's do th this will be simple and give it some more character I guess so we select that edge no vertex I mean sorry I'm not a pro oh yeah oh yeah I like that so it's still a little bit you know we could we could probably add some yeah let's I think we can work with this maybe we need to let's test this maybe if we select that one and you know just make does that look better or worse I think it actually is a bit of an improvement it doesn't get so square uh, I like the grill that the grill is square or the front where we will have some cool texture or something yeah let's yeah I like that so mm, could probably do the same here right and let's bring that one up a little bit should be a little bit flatter though there you know. yeah I like that well I'm happy with that I don't know if anyone else is but yeah let's do some vertical stuff here yeah that's probably good because now oh no what did I do ah there Mm, maybe. Yeah, let's do. Oh, we could do like that. Yeah. And now I'm gonna try to to flatten it a little bit up here, so it doesn't look so so much like a. Let's see here if we can bring this up a little bit. Mm. Uh, side, you know, that's front. That's, yeah, that's good. That is what we want. So, something like that, maybe. And then we will maybe we could bring these three a little bit up to so we maybe maybe not. No, does that look like shit? Well, maybe. Hmm. Maybe. 
maybe, maybe let's do it like this and let's bring that one up teeny weeny that one oh why so and that one too so no I think we need to straighten that up a bit so it doesn't look oh my god Like that, maybe. Then we could do s a window here later on. Yeah. Or at least. Ah, well. Let's see if we can. How does it look from above? Oh my god. We could make this, you know it like this maybe give it some flatness I don't know is this good ah uh, well it's a bit cool actually ah uh, well let's see what we end up with in the end I think that looks well could maybe to give it some so it's not really flat back here so let's see yeah you know we could you know that looks pretty cool I think that's what I think yeah and probably not have that so we could actually you know ah well it's just where ah well it's good for now it's good for now let's let's keep this basic thing I will save it save yeah that's the first part um, after this, I I I need to do um, we need a texture and stuff. So uh, I I'm gonna cut here because I'm hungry, and get back later. Bye. Hello, people. I'm back from dinner. Yeah, let's do this. We're gonna add a texture to this spaceship. We're gonna. Um, UV and wrap it and yeah let's see if we can do something fun with this yeah first of all we switch to the cycles render we will go to object mode and we will apply this modifier so now we get um, yeah, not the the mirror is gone basically because we don't need it an, anymore. I hope. Uh, yeah, and let's add a material to this. First of all, we already have a material, but we change the name to space. Craft mat. Yep, and we will bring up the node editor, I think. And yeah, let's use nodes. I've never done this before, but yeah, I've checked some tutorials. So let's see if I can do this. 
Um, we need the UV image editor and we need the texture or uh, rather we need to add an image to write on and let's call that yeah spacecraft no let's be consistent with our errors and yeah with height we'll probably be okay with that <coughs> and yeah to UV wrap we need to add seams to this mall so the first thing I will do is add a seam. Basically all sharp edges are good places to place seams. So let's do that. Oh no. What did I do? Yeah, wrong. We need that. So we will cut that around here. But we do not want this oh no so we remove this oh no no that and that and the same on the back side Gone, gone, gone. So, and we add that. So, Control E brings this. We will mark a seam. So, if we go to wireframe, yeah, wherever you are, there you are. We will have a red line. That's our seam. As I understand it, and we need more seams. Yeah, uh, let's work with the solid. So we will continue with this till. We have something. And I think we will cut out this because it's like a box you need to find all the seams so you can make a flat surface out of them all so let's make another seam mark seam mm, looks good This will simplify painting the grill, of course. Our frontal ornament. Yeah, looks good. Uh, Control E, mark seam. Uh, looks good. Then the back side of the model. This one is the simple one, I think. Uh, 
do 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 all these control E to mark seam and the last thing we need to do oh no like that all sharp edges are good places for seams okay let's see if we can mark e no control e mark seam um, let's see our creation here in wireframe wherever you are let's see here <gasps> beautiful I hope yep and like that And you will wrap. Oh, yeah, we need to select. And you oh, will wrap. Oh, my God. Looks fantastic. Right? So let's get some space. Let's move this one here. Oh, let's move. Ah. Okay. Yeah, maybe we should actually check if we have stretches. I don't think we have that because we'll rotate that one a little bit and yeah the rest and grab let's grab that one too that one too and that one too looks good or better so after doing that we need the node editor again and yeah we can remove the Stretch thingy of a majigger. Uh, where is yeah stretch? And remove that and bring out the node editor. And no, we need to I don't know. I'm not very efficient with this. So now we have, it, now we have the spacecraft texture, and we will link that with uh, uh, image one. Let's see where you are. Image texture, and take that one and move that to that and we have a solid but now let's go to the to the 
what is it called the no texture paint stuff ooh so now we have a because this image is black our spacecraft is black totally boring so we need to have a color we can work with let's do red red is good but yeah oh, blue maybe yeah let's do blue right now we will fill it all of this with no of course oh. blue blue or oh, well gray for now then what is this crazy stuff have I done something bad with the Behinds, let's see. Object mode and okay, edit mode then. And let's get to the bottom of this thing. What has actually happened here? Do we have this is a bit crazy. Why is why do we get all these strange ar artifacts? Hmm. Because no, we should be able to. Hmm. Let's try this again. Picture paint. What is this? Oh, there is actually. Okay. Let's go to fill and blue. Blue. Oh, what is this? So that's going to be. Well. Why is the color differing? strange but let's work with that something is ah well doesn't matter uh, let's save here save let's save this image because it's our save as image yeah why not spacecraft text PNG Save as image. So now we have our unwrapped image. Let's work on it with because I mean, if we go to F and our record now to our what? Our blender, yeah. And the spacecraft PNG. We have. We have something we can work with. Okay. We're going to make a really nice texture, maybe. Oh, yeah. Let's, by the way, let's not get hold. You know, we can do more. We should add a window, right? So, let's see here. What can we do, actually? Yeah, we can use another color maybe mm. let's see here maybe we can yeah let's take a, a, that one and not so big oh yeah uh, let's do one then that should be good enough or two so we can actually see the stuff so I guess if we mark we should be able yeah th there somewhere maybe all three of those let's see here uh, we have two maybe oh yeah 
there we should work on the bottom one that's the thing I think and we could make a window kind of here uh, we will mark every pixel yeah let's do that let's do a mark here with I don't know what color do you think red horrible uh, uh, pink better so there no why we're in texture paint mode or this is strange I should oh yeah now I know why we should use the paint what this mask editing I don't know what that is but let's just work with this right now maybe so we get the coordinates for our window maybe yeah let's do that yeah hmm let's check out what this mask thing is no don't know what that is okay paint let's do it the ugly way then um, I, I sure would like to have unified strength okay Oh, that's better I think maybe I don't know well <laughs> because now we have some kind of markings on our texture to make a window I probably need to to get the understanding for how you do this for reals I guess but don't be too fussy now we're gonna make a black window here cause spaceships need windows it's gonna be look awesome I hope so we have marked all those Vertices. So we ah yeah, let's do this. Okay, let's save the image again. Save image. Cool. Uh, let's open that one in an image editor. Maybe. Can I reload this? Ah oh, yeah. That's probably not gonna do anything. So. Let's open. Yeah, I have something. I have. I have this one. Paint Shop Pro. Let's try that out. If I can do something with this. I guess I have to open. Yeah, let's do this like that. Let's save it as um, save, and then we start to work with this. 
we need to first of all get rid of that stuff mm. bigger size it's too small let's work with this then. or maybe Exactly what we need. Oh God! To get rid of that stuff. Oh no! Yeah. Good. 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 Yeah. Maybe we should actually change the color. Do we like blue? No, we want red. Red is way cooler. So let's do Ferrari red. I have no clue. Yeah, that sounds. That looks nice. Oh God, no! That was not what we wanted. We maybe I have no clue. Orange. Something orange. -y. Let's see what now. That looks horrible. I'm such a bad color chooser. What is this? No, don't like it. Yellow could be cool or kill your eyes. Hmm, maybe blue isn't such a bad choice. I don't know. Uh, let's mm. let's do it. Ah, well, oh no, we killed the dots. No, we didn't. Cool. Let's do this. We need we need to paint some windows. Wonder if this tool has some kind of oh maybe I don't know pen tool oh. uh, probably maybe I should actually have a black color yeah that's way better. Where did my black go? Damn it. I said black, please. Okay. And then pen tool. Yeah. Let's see what this gives. Nope. like that and yeah we should probably work with 
removing all the stains from the old stuff. But yeah, oh, then we need then we need the color chooser. Uh, yeah, this was not the best. Uh, let's do one. Deal. Okay. Okay. Let's do that. Yeah. It won't show in the end. We're gonna. Remember that I'm a noob on this. I never done this before. It will probably show anyways, but yeah, I'm not gonna complain. So yeah, let's take black again, okay, and paint some. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's flood fill this thing. Where are you? Oh my god. This is not what I wanted. But yeah. Let's work with this. We will redo this stuff. If it's possible, yeah, it looks like it's possible. Let's rethink the whole strategy around this. We will use something else. We could probably use. Um, could we use no? Hmm. Plenty of shitty tools right now. Mesh work. What? We need paint. No, I want to make lines. God damn it! Why can I not make lines? Well, this is a work in progress. I need to figure this out. Back soon, guys. Yeah. Now I have figured out how to do this. Uh, I found the correct settings of the tool. So I added, uh, turned off to create on vector. And uh, turned on connect segments and both foreground and background are black and look at this yeah look at that please so now let's try this so now we will have a really nice window I think maybe we need to clean up some some stuff left by my lousy hand drawing but at least we have a window yeah let's hope everybody is happy with that one so uh, let's save that and let's bring that one and let's foreground yeah that's good and let's clean some oh no 
No, 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 no. And yeah, you see how l much time all this stuff takes cleaning up. Why is everything so difficult every time I do something? Okay, there we have something. And yeah, here we have two of that. And let's take care of that dot and go down. And, in. and then we take care. Yeah, let's hope this looks nice and oh no ah why yeah I can tell you things go a bit slow when I do stuff sometimes but it looks like this little thing is done now. Now we have a window. So let's figure out how to make the grill look awesome. Let's select that one maybe. Um, This will work, right? Won't it? Okay, or not? Oh my god. And, oh man. I'm doing the wrong thing all the time. So, this will work. Okay, let's try to use some filter to create the grill then. <laughs> yeah, let's see if I can get filter forge to work. First of all, it's probably want to update and Okay, let's see here. It's probably... Oh my god, of course. Oh, no? Okay. Let's... Let's see here. We will... See if we even can do this. <laughs> Filter 4. Okay. Need to close that, okay. Of course. Where did that go? Okay, now let's try this. Okay, okay. Why? Hmm. Hmm. Maybe I should try to do it like this we should maybe do another yeah why not why not and let's fill this thing with the color of Tilly, what color do we want? We want flood fill gray. Great. Uh, do, 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 do. Okay, there you are. Good. Um, file save. And then
Okay, let's see if we do effects. Filter Forge. Let's see if. Oh, yeah, I like that. So it's. Let's see here. We need to create something here. Uh, can I? Why not? Uh, no, no, no organic patterns, stone, techno. Sounds good. Mm -mm -mm. Preview size, actual. No, we want, we want only to Cas. Mm. I only want to apply that on that part. Well, it doesn't seem like tools. <laughs> Delete so means about. I want that. P -p 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 -p. Let's see here. <laughs> well, no. Creative. <laughs> I don't think we'll find anything here that works. No frames, patterns. I only want it to be applied to the. Okay, uh, can I maybe just select this? Maybe. Okay. Probably not, but frames. Oh, yeah, maybe techno. Uh, okay, <laughs> that doesn't work. No, why can't it just? Oh, yeah, no. This one is too darn no. Maybe, yeah, maybe settings size pixels. Okay, now we're talking. Hmm. Yeah, now we're talking. Okay, it won't be pretty, but it will probably let's make it bigger until it bursts. No, but okay, let's do it a hundred then. I should probably have gone with a, a larger texture, but what? The, let's see here. Seamless styling. Oh, what does it even matter? No, not in this. Ah, well, let's do it. Okay. 
Okay, not too bad. Actually, could probably, could probably make it even prettier, I guess. Let's try that. We we actually have something. Textured effect. We probably uh, well. Mm. Let's try that. Filter forge again. And settings. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hole size. Let's go for 15. Maybe. <sighs> Can you circular holes? No. Circular. Blah, blah, blah. No. Bevel. I don't know. C row shift. Okay. Now we're talking. Bevel with. I don't know. Hole size. I don't no, can I center it? Uh, bevel, no, so circular holes, yes. What is this? No, that was stupid. Can I do? Probably not. Let's do this. This looks kind of good. Yeah. Or maybe if we do the holes a little bit smaller. Yeah, it's uh, sometimes it's difficult to be me. Yeah, let's do the holes a little bit smaller or something. I don't know. Fewer. Bevel width, bump smooth, shadow size, hole size. Let's do 10 then. Let's try that. Can work. Apply. What? They grow? That's horrible. <sighs> well. <laughs> yep, effect filled forge. Or maybe settings. Can I actually? Oh, yeah, I can. That's good. Maybe this one is better. Or this one. Main. Yeah, let's do that one. It looks amazing. So zero shift no size let's do eighty that's that could be something maybe Why not? Hmm. 
but I sure want to kind of send I don't know uh, filter forge where are you filter forge or yeah, effects. There we have it. Oh. Or maybe there's something like this. Could look cool. Oh. Maybe just gonna. Let's try. Settings let's do hundred and I don't get why it can't be maybe we could do whole size 30 maybe 40 So if we do 10, what the fuck? If we do 10... So I guess it's the spaces. Beevil style show beevil width. Ah oh. so if we do twenty maybe I don't know. Let's see what happens. Now I'm stuck at this, just the grill. Well, settings, let's do a hundred. We do that. And why not? Let's see. Uh, Shadow, whole size 20, texture, uh, spread. So if I do. Well, 
Ah, it's good enough. Yeah, let's do it like that. And I guess actually that this one can be black. Make it black. That is good for me though. Okay. So where is the black? Or at least very grey. Can we please remove that and go to this one and do flood fill? We do save file, save effects. So we start with this and then we do some other stuff I guess. Yeah. Yeah, save. This is good enough. File export. And I guess we need to see mm, that uh, that's good. Probably good. Um, yeah, maybe we should not have. Okay. Just for. Let's do like we take a copy of the original one. <laughs> let's not. Let's not. Uh, let's not be stupid. Where are you? There you are. Copy here. Uh, good. Good, good, good. Do that. Save. Yes. Let's see how this will... What this will end up. How... Oh. We probably need to... Reload image. Oh yeah, we have we have something. <laughs> Check this out. Oh my god, that is ugly. Uh, well, let's see. We should now. We need to take a break because I'm so tired. But I need to next time. I will look into doing. Uh, you know, um, physical based rendering, rendering and stuff like that, and trying to do make this look better. Yeah, um, have have a pause. <laughs> I will have a pause later. So yeah, I have done more investigations here and let's see if we can get something working here. Okay, so let's get back to our, to our texture. Uh, let's begin with, with making a new layer here. New layer. 
you're a slave yeah and we have our front grill or ornament whatever selected and we create a new layer and then we bring this filter forge again and as you can see we have can create some nice stuff with this so let's bring norm normal and we will apply that on the new layer hopefully then we will copy this layer duplicate this layer normal yes uh, and this is diff Nice, but no. Then we will take this one and go here. I found a little. Oh crap! Cancel. Oh why? No, 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 no. Let's remove. Selection. Then we'll hide these ones, and we will only take that one file uh, image. Yeah, filter forge. And then we'll go to this one, and there's this normal map maker. And we'll apply this one. Let's see what happens. Yeah. And then we will basically do some small changes here. We will basically do like this. And we will we will oh sh no, like that merge merge selected yep and then we will mm, let's only have these ones and then we will have And then we will merge these ones, but we will do some changes to the to this one. We will do like this, I think. These two will be merged. Yeah. And then we will like we need oh please we will take this color and flood fill no and yeah wait maybe no Nothing is easy. Oh well. Size. Why not? No, this is gone. Now we will just. Now we will take this one.
the other ones we don't need, I think. This will be enough. It's my first one, so I'm not gonna be too... Let's see what happens, you know. First we will... Yeah, let's do it like... This we know. File... Export... to oh, come on I guess I'm tired now the the evening is late so Let's do some changes to this. We will remove this one and this one. We will add uh, a, yeah, this one will be good. Let's see here. Oh, come on. like that and then we will add a new image and I don't think we need to reload that oh well no we will add um, texture image texture like that and that will go to there we'll have this one and then Let's see if I remember this right now. We will have... We need a normal. Texture. normal map yes and then we will see if we can do something like this it's not ah well let's actually let's leave this object oh, and go to solid no texture or even better render so we will add let's see here probably new new I think this is correct. Vector. No, 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 no. Uh, texture. Oh, I'm so tired. Image texture. And we will open one, and that's the normal one, I guess. I have no clue. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, what is this? Oh. 
or we need to well yeah probably we probably need some yeah maybe looks like we have something that that looks more like a window now if I remove that yeah check that out there's some more depth I guess oh my god ah well it's it is what it is I guess I think we got it. I think it's, you know, it works. Well, this is my, <laughs> this is my spaceship. <laughs> uh, thank you guys for having the patience to, to hang around and watch me build a spacecraft. Maybe I will actually try to to use this in Godot engine or something but it has been a blast okay have a good night okay so I found several errors I've made in the end of uh, my model, uh, yeah texturing so as you can see <laughs> the the normal doesn't do especially much at all you see and I found out why and <laughs> yeah it's because the normal should not carry it shouldn't it's not color data so as you can see here it changed some however there's still no bumpiness or anything for for any reason <laughs> and the reason for that is basically my I don't know but my I saved my normal map completely wrong so however I found a much better way of generating the normal map so yeah I will show that now so I am using a program called ModLab that is free on Steam so I will launch that and I will open up my diffuse which is this one open so <coughs> from this I can generate a normal map uh, right now I will use generate from diffuse and as you can see this is much better uh, normal map than I had before actually um, and let's see here if we should do something more we should probably maybe or no maybe not maybe just a little bit more strength let's do it like that that's good uh, yeah and then we will export this to let's just call it st yes save and as you can see here now we have the ST diffuse emission normal roughness so I will just remove this one and oh, maybe actually do it like this so we get the name correctly so we take this yes no ah wow this sucks 
No. No. Let's see here. Uh, we can remove the other ones. And we go into Blender again. And we can... Uh, now you should have you see here there's actually details around the window I don't know if if we can see anything down here yeah it's a little bit more depth in in that but still well it's it's okay I guess but well, we did some improvements here. Uh, well, that's all, and uh, I will link all the resources I have used. I have actually some, oops, um, some I've used some resources um, to learning, and I will, of course, link them in the description of this video well thank you for watching have a good night